Alola. Welcome to the Wolf Pack. My name is Sand Distress 83. Hold on, let me turn down my volume. Better. Anyways, welcome back to Pokemon Legend Arceus. Last time we began to catch the mythicals, the rare Pokemon of this game. But we're going to take a little break from that and focus on this, because we have to go to report to some of the Captain Silene. Captain! Wait, Akia Akari? What are you doing? I'm trying to help the professor categorize their Pokemon's habitats, but there are just so many of them. Hey, Captain. Hey, Captain Silene? A cavern at Zoroa? In a place other than their natural habitat? Could this also have been caused by the space-time rift? I'm supposed we won't know that we don't know enough yet to say that for certain. Anyway, thank you for the report. Okay. Oh, we got something. Munch? Hey, it's my Sand, things are growing worse. After we parted, Munchlax reacted to several different locations, and there was a mass outbreak at each of them. Simultaneously, in multiple locations? There must be, these must be somehow different from the mass outbreaks we know. Why don't we call this a new phenomenon? A massive mass outbreak. Your new orders are to investigate the, this massive mass outbreak. Okay, so that's what we're going to call them. It sounds like I can count on you to keep, to keep investigating. Well, I'll, be, I'll be waiting for you by the, the front gate. Okay, okay. Okay, so we gotta go and help Mai out with this. Now, this whole video will be doing the entirety of it. Just to do it. Because I have nothing better to do. What's going on here? Oh, hey, it's Mai! Hi, my friend. Take a picture. Hello, it's been a while. I suppose I should tell you what exactly exactly what I witnessed first. Munchlax suddenly took off running into a rainstorm. I tried to stop him lest he get wet, but then I saw those mass outbreaks appearing all over. Perhaps it was the massive mass outbreak that Munchlax was so curious about. Man! If that's the case, Munchlax might be able to help us investigate this phenomenon. I'll also work with you, as I'm concerned about Munchlax. Yay! We can begin our investigation as soon as you're prepared. Are you ready to go now? Of course. Because I think you can find shiny, better chances of shinies than this. Excellent. Off to the heights camp week with us. Yeah, let's get to work. I actually um really want to get my job started. I love Munchlack. It's so cute. We, don't, we haven't seen anything out of the ordinary yet, nor has Munchlax reacted to anything. Shall we just wait for a while to see whether something happens? Yeah, of course. And now it's raining. It's raining. It looks like it's going to get worse. Man! Are you worried about the rainstorm, Munchlax? We still don't know what's causing these mysterious mass massive mass outbreaks. How will we find one? Perhaps that fancy map of yours can show us something. Yeah, my phone. I like Mai. She's pretty nice. Munch! Speak of the devil. Oh! <gasps> Mal many! A massive mass outbreak is a phenomenon in which many mass outbreaks occur at once. Mass outbreaks uh, locations are marked by question mark icons on the map. And you won't know what Pokemon it can be found there until you go see them. See, these rare outbreaks will dis dissipate in time, so you'll need to hurry to investigate them. Number two, catch or defeat Pokemon at a mass outbreak before it dissipates to finish investigating that particular location. Sometimes additional Pokemon may appear immediately after you complete your investigation. It seems you have some idea of where to look for these outbreaks now. 
Why not check out a few? See, at least three ought to get some idea of what's going on. Okay! Sorry, Bolo. We're gonna have to wait. Let's start with this. Who knows? I want to at least see them all first. So we got Ponyta. Oh, it was got Staravias and Star up there. Cool. Let's investigate everyone. Just so I can pick three. Okay, we got a Graveler here. One of them's an Alpha, too. There's a lot of these. I love this idea. Good work, developers. Another one. We have a Scyther outbreak. Don't get those every day. Which is technically true. Let's go to everyone. I want to see these first before I make a decision. You can never be too uncertain about something unless you check it out. No, and this one might be something useless I already have. We never know. Drift loon. So that was a drift loon outbreak. Cool, okay. Let's cover these by sky. I wonder if we'll find any good ones. The rainstorm shows no sign of stopping anytime soon. We have an outbreak. A Buizel. Okay, we got something of Ramanas. I'll check that out. And a bit. Yeah, Drew Bitoy, I want to go check this out. There's a lot of these. There's like a lot of Pokemon here, clearly. Let's see what this outbreak is. Found another Drifloon. Now let's go to Ramanas Island. What's next? Okay, we got another raid. Okay, we got like two. Okay. We got like three more to check out. Next up. The beach. 
And then or after these are done, all this is done, then we'll eventually go and take retake on the uh You know, the uh God Oh god, the wardens. Or the, the you know the noble Pokemon. In fact Let's go here. There's three more we got a few more we gotta do. Actually, there's only two. Yippee! I didn't think I'd ever see so many at, like this ever. This is awesome. Woohoo! Brainstorm shows no sign of topping anytime too. Might be on a hold of something here. If I can get at least one of them being shiny, I'll be happy. Okay, we got a. Uh... So we got a Cascoon Raid, okay. Oh! Hello! I didn't think to see you! Let's catch it! We have a shiny! That's a good luck! Okay, I didn't think we'd ever actually find one of you. Take them all out. Ow! We got an, a no, an alpha one. It looks cute. Scary, but cute. Let's go. A strong style aerial rifle. Okay, this one's very strong. Ah, this is nice. And you're heavy, so. Not nice, Ponyta. Bye bye. Wait. That's a Rapidash. Doesn't make to see one of you. Okay, here we go. You're not looking good. Here you go. There we go. All good. Okay. Let's keep fighting them. We got to this, we can do two more. And then we'll check them all out. This is fun. Last one. You know what, that's this. We'll check out Scyther. Or maybe not. I don't know what else I want to check out. Okay. 
Okay. Okay. Not bad. What's next? Okay. I'll check out Scyther. Anywho, um, onwards! To my braviary, pals. Who are you? Hello? Sure, it's tough. I have some my What's this? Huh? What the heck? Um, that was weird. I don't know what the point of that was. Let's go. Come on, Sneasley. Let's go. This may sort of may go on a bit longer. Okay. Onwards to the Scyther Ranch. Oh, Can these things just go away? <laughs> Burn it on! All of you! That's right, you can't beat me. This is very good music weather. Yeah. Let's go. Oh my god. Anyways, a nice beam. Here we go. Not bad. And I rock. Let's take them all down until we can get a, if we can get a shiny one. Then. Cause ah, if not, oh well. Oh, and this one's an alpha. That is great. There. Oh, yeah, the sword stance. Okay, that might. Okay, that's not good for me. So I need to be careful. And take this thing down immediately. And it's. Yeah, that's not good for me. Not good at all. Okay. It's all fun. I can do this. Maybe. I hope. Give me that stuff. Okay, I got some goodies. Okay. Not bad. Oh, 
Oh, I forgot I have a leaf stone, apparently, from last time. I'm an idiot sometimes. I forget I have all these good items. There we go. None of you are surviving, Cypher. Okay? Don't worry. Just kill them all. We better hurry. Just take them both on. Yeah, that's better. Down. Okay. And down. Okay, we'll just take on the raid out the, the outbreak on the Florida Garden. Okay. Man. Okay, time to end it. Let's piss them all. That's better. All at once. And a shadow ball for you. Check. Did you drop? Oh, stuff. Okay, that's that's not good. Okie dokie. Let's see. Not so good. And another one for you. You got me a flower. One for you. Sure. You got flowers. You got a mystical fire. I know that the Driven can learn that move. Ow! Took you long enough. Let's get them all. There we go. Three of them. Two for the three for the price of all. There we go. There we go. There, 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 there we go. Oh, that's right. I'm psychic, or at least part psychic right now. Not very pleasant. My offensive. And um. Okay. Let's hope these are the last two left. For this horde. Or outbreak. Oh yeah, you're a ghost. They should help. Ow. We check something.
Where's my? And there we go. I think I might have screwed up myself a little. You know what? That mystical fire. I have a lot of data. I even caught this guy last time. The heights. So, let's find my... Oh, there she is. I want her to stay here, honestly. Thank you for your investigation in the Obsidian Fieldlands. More stuff. Did you already about these massive outbreaks? They come in rainstorms. What could that mean? Do Pokemon gather when it's especially heavily rain? I wonder whether Munchlax was reacting to the rainstorm or to the massive mass outbreak itself. Well, I just have to investigate further, but how best to do so? Got a good look around the obsidian field lens, but it only raises more questions. That frown doesn't shoot you at all. Kalaba! Hi, Yuja! Oh, Mistress Kalaba. Well, you see... Yeah, we're investigating these massive mass outbreaks. Mass outbreaks that occur during rainstorms. I've never heard of such a thing. But of course, life is full of surprises. After all, it's not often that Pokemon from beyond our world come up would appear at the Temple of Sinnoh either. Perhaps these Pokemon are arriving to the arrival of Mighty Palkia. Why don't we head back to Jubilee Village? As Erezu's shop may be a good place to visit. The girl's off place is awfully popular after all. And where people gather, information abounds. Of course, the hairdressers. That might just work. I agree. Why don't we put... Why, don't, why we won't learn anything new if we simply stay put? It sounded. I'll wait for you at the hairdressers. Okay, my. We're heading home. Actually, I just realized something. I could report my findings to you. So you caught one Pokemon? Yeah, I caught a shiny! A shiny Ponyta! Yay! I'm happy. Oh! We did a lot of work. We almost there to rank up. Let's head to the village. Right oh, with the security corps been scoring us, it'll be a nice safe trip back to Jubilee. I'm happy. My data. My research. Hello, Arizu. Hey, it's the gang. I was good. Oh, yeah, my team's better. Hello, guys. It's been a while. Oh, Sam, Mrs. Calaba's waiting for you. Come on in. Hello. It's nice to go in here. I heard all. I heard all about those massive mass outbreaks. I bet there's some sort of Pokemon festival. It's like what I heard from a customer who came here from Johto. Apparently, on nights when a, a full moon, Clefairy gather get together and dance. It's basically a gathering of Pokemon that only happens when certain conditions are met. Sounds pretty similar to massive mass outbreaks, don't you think? So massive mass outbreaks could be a festival for Pokemon to enjoy the rainstorms. You might have a point. It seems to me you're still biting your tongue, Arizu. Have you heard anything else? Well, I did hear something weird from a Diamond Clan friend of mine. Go on. They said they saw a mass outbreak of Alphas in the Crimson Mirelands. Seriously, do Alphas even ga ever gather in groups? My friend must have made a mistake, right? Alphas grouping together. 
If this is part of a massive mass outbreak, it sounds dangerous. Man! Even the Lady of the Ridge would be no match for a mass outbreak of alphas. It's natural to worry about the unknown. That's why Sand is investigating this for us now, to put our concerns to rest. You're right, it seems our next stop is to investigate the Crimson Mirelands. Yay! Are you ready to head to the, back to the Crimson Mirelands with me? Of course. Also, I like her outfit. Look, it's, it, the, the way her outfit was made, it really suits her. Excellent, now let's be off to the Mirelands camp for some massive mass outbreak research. This will also be good for my decks to get fill in more data. And of course, it rains. It seems a massive mass outbreak has sprung up here in the Crimson Mirelands too. Let's try to determine this phenomenon phenomenon occurs here as it does in the obsidian fields. Hey ho, little people. No need to fret, Melly's arrived. Ugh, it's her. What do you want? I heard rumors that you've been investigating massive mass outbreaks or some such. But I, Melly, have, have already gab solved the mystery. All that remains is the gab evidence. Really? Not bad, Melly. The reason these Pokemon ga have been ga mysteriously gathering rainstorms is... Out of it already! To give praise to the great Melly, naturally. <sighs> you know what? Thumbnail time! You know what? I'm gonna make that my thumbnail for this video. Hold on, fellows! It's picture time! Sorry, Melly, you won! Check! Melly looks honestly very possessed. Don't look so sour, you two! I do hate her, though. I realize it's a difficult truth to accept right away, but I, the awe I inspire as both sun and shadow to Adamon is clearly apparent to Pokemon. And as thanks for your adorable efforts in proving my theory true, I'll give you this generous reward. You better be good and be good. Go on, take it. They're Agua Berries. Quite a rarity here in Hisui, you know. Oh! As for why these Pokemon gather during rain stories, well, that's surely to represent how I'm simply overflowing with, mar with wonderful qualities. And with that nugget of wisdom, I shall be off. Dumbass. He was very shy and withdrawn as a child. Wait, that was a he? He was very shy and drawn, withdrawn as a child until one day when he announced he was going to work hard to help Adam out. I was happy to see. I was happy to see him grow more optimistic, but I fear he might have taken that to extremes. Wait, that was like Melly's a dude. But Agua Berries, where could he have found them? Munch. Munchlax, did you just eat some of the Agua Berries? Munchlax got about five of them. Dude, Munch, Munch. What's this? It looks like your fancy map is responding to Munchlax again. Yeah, Munchlax. Way off. <gasps> oh, oh, okay. Oh. I'm going here. Specifically for this. There's a Cyndaquil outbreak, too, and a Grotto. Now no maps. Now, hmm, not a map not only shows the outbreaks located, but the Pokemon there as well. Oh, I know where I'm going. I'm going to Haunter. What does this mean, Munchlax? <laughs> While massive mass outbreaks are, out, are ongoing, you can give a guav berry to Mize Munchlax to find out what Pokemon are appearing at each location. Pokemon icons. Wait. 
So these may be. Wait a minute. Does this mean there are sh these could be shiny? Okay. So while Pokemon icons with a spark with a sparkle mark. Mark the locations of special mass outbreaks, while those with a po very indicate indicate mass outbreaks where you may be able to receive mass receive aguave berries. Be sure to make the most of these to help you out with your investigations into mass massive mass outbreaks. So if we keep feeding Munchlax aguave berries, we'll be able to learn more about these outbreaks. Munchlax, I what exactly is it you're trying to get us to understand? Whatever, whatever it is all it means, please investigate three massive mass outbreaks locations in the Crimson Mirelands. So we can complete compare these outbreaks to those we found in the Obsidian Fieldlands. Okay. Well, I'm, I'm going to start here. So I, does that mean that they're shiny or that they're, they're just special? Whatever, I'm going to go check it out. Who knows, I can find a shiny. So that's cool. Let's find out. Take them all out. Look at the size of these guys. So annoying. These are some overpowered haunts, huh? Oh, that's right, I'm part dark, so poison types that moves don't affect me much. There we go. I hope I can get a shiny one, that'd be helpful. Okay. And you missed. Or that thing simply avoided. Whatever. Not bad. Also, I need to get a Rotom in this game. Mainly because I have those appliances. And I need to figure out what that's all about. Actually, what is the deal with with, with Rotom and the appliances anyway? Like, what has that benefit besides changing its type and appearance? Oh, an Alpha Gengar! What level is the Gengar? 83! That is a big boy! Let's put him to sleep. Let's put it down. Oh, it survived. <laughs> Don't worry, it won't last long. This might... Samurai Jack may not. Oh, no. Oops. Man... You know what? Let's have a little fun. Let's send out Rogue. Rogue is actually one of my better Pokemon in this case. You know, obvious reason. It's a it's a poison flying type. It means it can attack, be super effective against many typings. You know, very useful. And it's not that weak to dark types at all. It can be hurt by them, but it doesn't mean it's super effective. It's weak to them. And look at that candy. A rock! Kind of looks like an egg for some reason. We found two Gengar! Hold on. Okay, let's heal you up, buddy. Let's power up. 
Okay, I got four storms. Heal up my team. Oh man. None of your shiny. What the heck is wrong with you? That looks wrong. And take you down. Bye, Gengar. And we'll take out this Alpha one as well. It's really powerful looking. I honestly might use a Gengar in my team. One of these teams. I don't know. And let's try and take out one hit. Or not yet. Rest. Man. Doesn't matter, you're still hurting. There we go. And now it's down. Let's check out a Cyndaquil. That looks fun. Oh no, yeah, we're not done. A lot of alphas. That is a horde of alpha haunter. I need my whole team just to deal with this. Look at these guys. No! He got an attack! That's not good. Can I run? Let's set up this as my main one. Oh no. Okay. Onwards! See you later! Uh, that was scary. I didn't like that. Hold on. How do you guys like the rain? Does it help your crops? Hold on, let me eat something. Let me eat. Huh. Let's use this. Okay, we're gonna check out your uh, other thing. I really want to check out this Cyndaquil raid. Oh. Hello. Oh, see the quill look cute. Hmm. Not bad. Mm-hmm. 
Oh, God. Mm -hmm. This is very helpful indeed. Thank you, guys. <laughs> Not bad. You do not get very far. Hmm. Let's put you out. A little like this. And a uh, little. No. Where'd it go? Bad one. Who is that? I don't know. I'm curious. I'll pass, but I'll be about you in a minute. I'll bow you eventually. A G an alpha lick licky. Cool. Awesome. Hello. To bronze on and a wait. One of them was bigger. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Okay, that was not good. Let's do a strong style. That'd be lots of fun. And I'm doomed. 
I'll get Jamie! <clears throat> Good work. Everyone's getting really powerful. Hmm. Bye, Bronzo. I'm depressed. None of these are even shiny. I'm upset. These aguave berries are very good. I'll steal with them. Okay. You're not going down so easy, are you? It's pretty cool. Okay, challenge accepted. Clap for bronze, I'm going down, everyone's gonna lose! Okay, Shadow Ball. I'm actually glad I taught this thing Shadow Ball. Very powerful move right now. Okay. And you know what? We'll use another one. Save up my flamethrowers for tougher opponents. Target located! We'll just put it out of its misery. See ya! <laughs> Two down. Hold on. Before I actually do, I want to finish up this raid with Outbreak with the uh, Haunter. I want to see if I can get a shiny one. You know? Oh, hey. Let's battle all four. That's a great idea. Yeah, because that's a good idea. Look at them all. I'm doomed. Can it be my turn? There we go. That did not take it out. Theirs was much powerful. This is not good. Why is everyone just looking around? Like, You okay? Okay. You're all fine. Um, after this, you might not be, though. Sorry. You take a good rest, Rogue. You've earned our good rest. You took down one alpha, only three more to go. Yeah. This scares me. And there. That's another one. Drop everything. We're getting a lot of candy. We're gonna get like four pieces of candy out of this. That's actually very helpful. Eat shit. Eat this. And fire. That's another one down. What's the size of the candy? Another medium piece of candy. Everybody loves the candy. Let's go. Oh, it didn't even move. It was too sleepy. Wait, isn't Shadow Ball supposed to be a ghost type move or something? Wake up! Oh no. Samurai Jack might want to wake up. 
Stop! Wait, did they fix it? Can I just move? Better. Thank you. Oh no! More alphas! This is bad. Even for me. Okay. Get a remedy. Let's use these remedies. These should help. Not bad. Everyone's back in tip-top shape. For this one, I think we'll leave things off with you. And guess what, guys? All the alphas are not happy to see me. That's good. And I'm asleep. You know what? On second thought, let's run away. Let's go. None of these guys are shiny. They're not gonna be. Let's just leave. There's a lot of them. Maybe. We're fine. What a a shiny haunch murkrow. Actually, have I ever had one? What the hell is that? Okay, actually, change of plans. Let's actually check out this murkrow outbreak. What was that? I heard something. Oh. Hello! A shiny Gumi! I'm catching you! Like it or not. Like it or not. I want to actually catch this. I want a shiny Gumi. Thank you! Thanks for letting me catch you. That's two shinies today. We have just got luck. And now... To check out the alpha or the, the outbreak of Murkrow. Plus, I gotta get more aguave berries anyway. This is a little something for me. Hello, Mr. Murkrows, Mr. and Mrs. Murkrow. Let's go. This will be good training. And if we can get a shiny one, huzzah! If not, oh well. Eventually, after this one, we will be going to report this back. I'm not going to quit. I quit. Let's head home. Anna caught me a Gumi. That's very rare, even for me. Where's Mai? Oh, hi, Mai. Hmm. I hear you finished your investigation in the Crimson Mile Islands. Well done, Sam. Hi, Irida. Irida is here to help us. What happens twice will happen thrice, or so they say. Massive out, massive mass outbreaks seem likely to occur in the Cobalt Coastlands and other areas as well. So I've been discussing the issue of Irida. 
Why don't we demonstrate to her what has been keeping us so busy? We can turn our next investigation to the Cobalt Coastlands next. Munch! Ah, yes, Munchlax, I know it's keeping you busy. But you, what's been keeping you busy is eating. Don't worry, you'll get your berries. But I still wonder, what lies behind Munchlax's strange reaction to eating a guava berries? How does it know which Pokemon are gathering where... where... Which, yeah. How does he know which Pokemon Gavin wear during a massive mass outbreak? He's got superpowers? Perhaps. Hopefully our investigation show will shed some light on this mystery. Well, let's let me offer you a hand. I learned some things about massive mass outbreaks myself. I know the leader I knew the leader of the Power Clan could help us. Mysteries going on in vast too piqued my interest after all. And on top of that, we're friends. I al I'll always come if you ask for help. Friends. We'd seen each other all, all, all there around before. But after the, talking more at the Harmony Festival, we found we agreed on a lot of things. Such as how we think Adamon, how exactly, such as how exactly we think Adamon is doing as a leader. And we decided we'd help each other out, despite being from different clans. Anyway, that's how I got involved with the investigation of the coastlands. And I heard from East Guy and Lena that they both see something like a mass outbreak, but stranger. What are you what are your thoughts on these mass and mass outbreaks, Irida? Well, I wonder what about what about them caused Pokemon to flock together this way. Perhaps there's been some shift in space because of Mighty Palkia's appearance? I'd certainly be glad to have more Pokemon around, and it would help Pisui flourish. But it's too early to conclude it's all for the best. Hordes of strong Pokemon can be dangerous. I, I'll i be sure to warn, warn Lena up to be careful, too. I would do that, yeah. I'll head to Jubilee Village once I wrap up a few things here. So wait, after we're done this... No! Man! Oh well, I can always do something terrible. Oh, I. Later, be you fair. Anyways, yeah, when we can meet at the front gates when it's time to set out for our next investigation. Ooh, more stuff. Screw this. I'm just giving up on these ones. Okay, I caught a shiny Goomy from here in Hisui. I'm actually happy. So I caught two shinies today. That's great. Oh. We're almost able to rank up. Let's head to the village. In fact, I want to see if the guy has anything new to sell. Hey, Maya, we'll meet you up in a bit. I just got some business here. Unless I have too little money. Hello, Ginter. You know what? I'll take some scatterbangs. What do you have in store? Sand radish! I do need some of these. In fact, before we head out to the to our next location, I need to go and get complete stuff in here real quick. Excuse me. Hello. Ah, uh, the survey corps. Who recruit, who recruit who quelled? The Lord of the Hollow. I'm sorry to keep you. You keep getting real from the errands on my account. Is that true? I'd be happy just to get my corpse products all, out to the store shop for free. But what that that mean? Letting Choi off the hook. And the very idea that sets my that very idea of that sets my teeth gnashing. Are you bound for the Alabaster Iceland soon? Would you bring me back free sand radishes? Uh... Oh, you're back with the veggies. Well done, Gavin, the harsh climate. 
Yeah, take them. Give me more items in the store. Ah, sand lashes, radishes. The alabaster Iceland's finest feature. If you give these bitter roots a, a nice thorough pickling, it brings out a unique sweetness. Once they're pickled, they make for a lovely, crisp, and quite well-liked snack. My granddaughter is makes a fine pickle. Tell you what, I'll perhaps I'll ask her to give one of these a nice briny soak. Anyways, I'm sorry to have kept you waiting on using kept kept on using you as a go-between with Joy. I suppose it's time I had a proper conversation with the wife. Uh, I'm excited to get. I actually realized. I think I've, I'm almost at maximum ranking, by the way. Eh. Now listen. I'll set you up with some new goods, but not as a fa not as a favor to sand. Not you. Don't think for one second that this means I've accepted you. But Tao, who is sir? Oh, please, Grandpa. I can't believe this is still an issue for you. Yui. How long have you been? What? Is our little store not worthy to sell your goods? Talk about letting personal feelings get in the way of your business. If you keep this up, Grandpa, I swear I'll never speak to you again. Ugh. But why, sweet Yui? You swore you'd never get married and leave your poor cramps. Aw. Who in their right mind make time, takes a tiny child's word so serious? I'm so sorry, my grandfather. Grandma's been such a bother to you, Stan. I hope this doesn't put you, you put you all visiting our shop. Oh, is that your wife? She looks nice for her age. Well, in any case, we got some excite excellent new items on our shelves. Do buy some. What did you? What is there exactly to buy? Oh, well, we got more stuff, but not much. Nothing's really changed. Let me check the recipe item menu, because I need to check that, actually, for recipes, you know? Crafting recipes. Oh my god. What's all this leaf stuff? I don't really need, I have need for them. Oh my god. There we go. Okay, now we can go to work. How many areas do I have to explore? The next stop in all of our investigation is to look for massive mass outbreaks in the Cobalt Coastlands. Thanks as always for all the help. Done. Let's set off to the beach can. Hey, it's you! What a fine supplies meeting you two out while fetching supplies for our settlement. Hey! Garrick! Kalava filled me in. You two, you're looking into massive ma mass outbreaks that happened during rainstorms. Hold on. I t I'll tell you what I recommend. Sticky globs. Oh! <gasps> Thank you! And a Pokemon with a sticky glob will saw it right down. I bought the recipe at the Craftworks myself by a request from the settlement. I better get back to the Icelands. Not that it'll be take much time with well-trained legs like these. <laughs> 
Interesting. The Pro Clan is recommending the Galaxy Team Sticky Globs. Alright then, let's head off to the beachside camp. I'm excited. See what kind of Pokemon we can find. Maybe I can get a Rotom. It's Professor. It seems we arrived in time to catch another massive mass outbreak. Remember, Garrick's wise, perhaps those sticky gloves could be a big help. Anna, let's begin our research. You can let me know if you wish to give Munchlax some berries as well. I will grant you a bit of insight. Thank you. Oh, okay. Uh, okay, I'm going to start with Finneon and Chatot first. We'll start with the Finneon. We'll start here. If we can get a shiny one, that'd be even nicer. This is a really good opportunity for shiny hunting, for those of you who don't know. Hold on. A new horde seems to have formed. Hold on, I want to grab this. Is there more? Hmm? Okay. Okay. Yeah. Uh, back here, back here. Next up, Chatot. Here we go. Hello, my. Oh my god, an alpha chaton. Hold on. I found another wisp. It requires my attention. We have one wisp to find. And we will found them all.
Take it on, babies. What, what level was this thing? 77? Okay, ice beam. Oh, it's... Oh, so apparently fairy said, wait, fairy hurts dark? I didn't know that. I'm in trouble. I might be in trouble. Okay, I knew about Bug, okay? These guys are mean. Let's have a little fun. Wait, this Chachan knows Hurricane. You just one hit my tur my Chotara. You son of a bitch. I'm gonna have to kick your ass. How strong are you? Better, I can put it out of its damn misery. Down. That's better. He's really in. Oh, I see the mastery! And you! That's more, you're starting to kind of annoy me. There we go. And it's down. This one's an alpha! Oh, great. You know what? We're just gonna leave. Let's actually check out this next place. Let's check out Skorupi. The Skorupi place might be good. Yeah, do we want to get up Shiny Primper? That thing's getting annoying. Scared me a little bit. <sighs> Why did I use the candy? I'm losing some good stuff. On the bright side, here I just gotta find one more wisp. So that's going well. Oh, 
Okay. There we go. Oh, man. Why are you? Deploy. Ports of my. There you go, my. It seems the Survey Corps really does get the job done. I'm glad I asked for you for help. I'm also glad we got we can get information from the Pearl Clan more easily now. I've got to handle it. I got even more information from the Survey Corps to offer, my. Professor Lavington and I have been researching these massive mass outbreaks, too. Captain Silene's orders. I'd be grateful if to hear about anything you discovered. I'd be happy to, sir. I just have one little request first. Sand, battle me, please. I need to train more in order to become an even greater member of the circles. I'm taking. I'm wait. I'll be waiting for you. Dinka call landing. Wait. We really have to fight her. Uh. I guess we gotta do it. You know what? The finger her will be a piece of cake. Hello, Akari. You're ready to lose. You will have to ban me if you want to learn more and learn more about massive mass outbreaks. You're on. You've solved a lot of problems for us since you fell from the sky. But I still have more Survey Corps experience. I need to prove that you can depend on me. You have five Pokemon? You got a Clefairy! Hydro pump. That was sad. Oh. And Ice Beam. This is good training as well. I love the music. What else has you got? Your Pikachu hasn't evolved? Wait, yours has Volt Tackle. That's its signature move. For those who don't know, um, the, the, uh, move Volt Tackle is a signature move for this Pikachu. For any Pikachu, really. In fact, for the entire uh, Pikachu line. Pichu, Pikachu, Raichu, Alolan Raichu. You name it, it can have it. And you gotta start after. Not bad. Why well, ever have to fight you eventually? I am now, but you know what I mean. And meanwhile, I'm still this... I love how she's been here longer than me, yet I'm still this powerful guy who just came out of nowhere. That's very entertaining to me. Also, I was hoping her Pikachu would have evolved by now into a Raichu. Ugh. Wait, you gotta have a Monferno! That's your new friend! Is there something you're not telling me? Do you have all three of the starters? Shouldn't this thing also- I feel like this thing should also be something else. Mr. Mine. Not good. Just kidding. Ha! <laughs> Bye! 105 damage. 
Bye bye. Bye, Akari. What an incredible strength. strength. I'm proud to call you my protege. I am not your protege. I have better experience as a Pokemon trainer. You're incredible, San. I want to become strong like you. I can become a worthy opponent, and I know I could do. I could do the Survey Corps proud. Pika! Pika, do you understand how I feel? If we can understand each other, that means Pikachu I really can get stronger. And th I think we'll start by sharing a nice big plate of potato mochi. See you later, then. Oh, yeah. I know. I forgot to say what I came to tell you. I'll explain what the professor said and I discuss. We think Pokemon are gathering around lingering traces of energy left behind by the space-time rift. But we need to investigate more to learn how those energy traces relate to the rainstorms. I don't understand a word you're saying, but it sounds like you know what you're talking about. I promise I'll become an opponent wherever you to use, Sam. One you can depend on when you want to grow stronger yourself. I'll see you later, my... What an interesting child. I like the Survey Corps. It's good to see young people so passionate about their cause. Aren't you a kid? Well, Alright, next we visit the Coronet Highlands. Or at least that would be a plan. But I get to hear a, a single sight of the mass outbreak, massive mass outbreaks in the Highlands. And when we do hear a, when, and if and when we do hear of any sightings there, let's meet up at the Highlands camp. Thank you. I'm gonna give up on these raids, on these outbreaks, only because I want to head home. Let me see all my Pokemon. I don't want to do that. Okay, let's get a whole lot. There we go. There we go. Support our findings. We got a lot of money. And I think we got some good work done. Oh, it seems you made... Ooh. We're almost there. Let's return to my village. That's right, my village, fool. Foolish mongrel. Oh, hey, it's you. Wait, what are you doing here? By my village. Hello, my. Man, I have something important to discuss with you. I heard an odd rumor. I think it might, it may, I believe it may be the key to unlocking the mysteries behind massive mass outbreaks. You must first acquire ten mushroom cakes, then bring it to the secret hollow in the Alabaster Icelands. I call this my tricky treat strategy. That's what I'm doing, Munchlax. I'll be waiting out for you in the Alabaster Icelands in the Sea Hollow. Oh. Of course, I need some uh, food. Mushroom cakes. I need a lot of them. Wait, what? Oh my, oh my, oh. 
This place just got bigger. Can I have mushroom cakes? We need two, four. We have what we need. Space Cadet. You know what? Let's use some of these rocks. Let's really max out my team. Okay. Okay. Let's do some exchanging because, you know, we can't go wrong there. Hello, it's Ingo! It's nice to see you again, my dude. Love what happened to your outfit. I hope you know that. Nice to see you again, my friend. I want to learn the moves. Oh. I want to exchange some things. Larger, please. Let's keep the exchange going. Grit pebbles. Alright, screw you. Wait, the secret hollow. Alabaster Icelands. Okay, not bad. I'll give it a check out. I mean, but before we do that, we gotta chat by, stop by here for a very special reason. Chat with you. You find six more. Wait, how many do we have to find? I need to bring back thirty-three more. How many do we have left to find? I got all the ones in Jubilee Live. There are three in the Obsidian Fieldlands, two in the Crimson Mirelands, one in the Cobal Coastlands, 11 in the Corner Highlands, and 16 in the Icelands. I'm going to have a lot of hunting to do for all these. You know what? It's going to be fun because I can get a spirit tomb out of it. And outside the village. Oh, hey. Let's head out. We're going to do this whole thing tonight. The rest of this tonight. In fact, I want to chat with my girl. Who are you first? What do you want? A book about him. <gasps> Bergmite! I love it. What? I cannot allow that. Okay. Let's find someone. A specific someone. I think this other one has to have been Irida. There's no other explanation. If there's someone out there, show yourself. I'll check this out. Hi ho. All right. Hello. You're just the per. Wait, I actually get to fight you. Hello, Sam. I was just about to give, tell you something. This to go find you and tell you about this precious, incredible treasure thing I found. Are you curious? Tantalized? I am curious. 
You usually should be. There isn't a single person up in all fantasy who would be interested in treasure. But anyway, before I show you, can you guess what I want to do? You want to battle? Yes, I want to be able to achieve feats like yours. Like what you did atop Mount Cornet. Now give me one moment, I need to center myself. My partners are going to get stronger and travel all across this world. We have to fight? Come on, Jack! You have an Eevee! <gasps> oh, you got a Glaceon, an Espeon, and a Flareon. Out you go. I'll start with you. So these guys have Eevee Lucian! I actually need to find Espeon. I'll build your partner, Glaceon! Weak! You know what? Just print it out. And down! Okay! Wow, oh, I wonder if they're up oh, I guess, here, the treasure I found is. A lustrous globe! When, oh, this, they called it a globe! When used on Pokemon, this large glowing orb swells Within with power and allows the Pokemon to change form. I held I told this once belonged to the founder of the Pearl Clan. It's somehow connected to all my sin er to Mighty Palkia, I mean. And since Mighty Palkia is with you now, I'll entrust the glo the lustrous orb glow to you too. Thank you, San, for everything. Oh, shards. Wait, is it? It's a it's a hit it's a oh. What was I doing? Oh yes, I have to do something. Greetings. Hello. No one's here. Will you wait for mine? No wait. What has happened? Oh, it is getting cold. Took you long enough, my. Did you bring me tiny mushroom cakes? Yeah. Well, well then. <laughs> mushroom cakes and some quality ones today. Now we're just getting started. Leave the rest to me. You can return to Jubilee Village. I will share how my stra successful my strategy was when I finished. Okay. Cool. Let's head home. Sand! Dan, actually. What's up, Sand? Or Lian? I had a visit from Melly. He came all this that way. Just to post about giving you some guava. He said to it you lit up when, with so much joy that you smell nearly split your face. I can't imagine that was the case. I'm sure it was a confused grim or smile you nearly forced yourself to give him out of pity, but I still can't let myself be outdone by him. So I've been looking out for you all for Hisui. To give you this, I'm my very own reward. Dude, it's not too far superior to anything Belly can give you. More Guav! Oh, and I did see one of those massive mass outbreaks on your on my way here to find you. I wonder if they might be caused by the geology at the place where it occurred. Perhaps there is some mysterious kind of stone in the ground which draws Pokemon here. Oh, and I have a message to you from Mai. She would like to meet with you in Jubilee Village. 
Back in Jubilee? Yep, she's been waiting there for you. Though I suppose it's more accurate to say that she's been chatting her way with Sugumi from the security code to help you. As for me, I think I may visit the hot spring since I've come all this way. Do be careful of any massive mass outbreaks as you head back. Strong Pokemon might appear. Well, friends, let us head. Glaceon is helpful. Let's return to the village. <laughs> I need to find you, Mai. We're gonna have a little word chatty. Where's Mai? Mai! Mai, Mai, what's on your mind? Um, mushroom cakes? What in the world are you talking about? Mushroom cakes and strategies? Much? Come to think of it, Irida did also came to me with an odd request. She asked me for hearty green, so I gathered some for her. Could it be some Pokemon taking the guise of, po of people to figure out mischief? Tricky treat. None of this is why I called you here. Mind. I came to tell you that a massive mass outbreak has been recorded, reported in the Coronet Highlands. The next stop in our destination is to investigate the Coronet Highlands. Let's see what we can find there. Let's see what we can get in general. If you're ready, shall we set out? Deal. Very good. We should we should start out from the court the Highlands camp then. I'm excited. Now let us continue. Sayan! Hi, Sabi! And I? What brings you here? I heard you're because of a vision that my clairvoyant, clairvoyant voyance showed me. Some poor soul is running from their life from a bunch of alphas. I just barely saved them. It's as I feared. These massive mass outbreaks really are growing out of hand. Sam, we must endeavor to find the truth behind why they keep happening. Big packs of Pokemon might not be much trouble if you've got a trusty partner, but if you don't, eat. I'm scared just thinking about it. You did well save that person, Sally. You're as fine a protector as any lord or lady Pokemon. Thanks, my. If my clairvoyance shows me anyone else in trouble, I'll do my best to save them, too. Just be careful while you're out there here, okay? She's right. We don't know how strong you are. We don't know how strong you are, but we should move with caution here. Wait. Okay, Munchie. Let's see what we got. Oh. Oh, girl! Yeah. Okay, so we could get a shiny Cleffa. Okay, let's set our eyes on you. Okay. Let's check out everything just to play it nice. Hi, right, Melly. Oh, hey. Yeah. Let's check you out. Who knows? I could get lucky. And get something. I don't know. And huh. ow! We don't have Cluff Fairy. Oh, hey, a Cluffa. These little guys. Okay, they're done. That's two. Oh, hey, more are spawning. 
More levels up. And you're down. Next up is Gabite. Now let's kick to the skies, my friends. Okay, well, check out you because I actually want to see. The rain does not show sign of stopping. Good. We don't want it to stop. We want it to keep on going. Going, going, go. Hey, what Pokemon are you? Is that a Magnezone? Isn't that a Magnezone? Oh, I have a Magnezone! Cool! Oh, hey, Gabby Art. I do not have one of these. Hold on. Back up. Let's hope we can catch one. Ow! That's it. Let's just fight them all. It's really... This is starting to get on my nerves. Heavy ball. Can these things just get caught? Truth be told, I need to catch A1 anyway. We all know when they shard up and they start to spawn. No one does. Dragon Claw. Okay. You're starting to get kind of annoying. Please just let me catch this one. Come on! Mm. Mm. Cool. So nice. Ice ping. Down and one go. These things actually drop it. I don't even know. I'll see what you drop. It can drop anything. Oh, you dropped something. What is that? Is that salt? Let's try again. Let's try with you. You should be easier to catch. Hopefully. There we go. You caught one. Let's just run. On second of all, let's run away. 
Not worth it. See you later! We do need a shiny Yanma. Okay, but first, I want to check out this uh, gas leaf thing because, well, for those. Oh, hey, Whisk! Didn't think these were here. Got another one. Ten wisps to find. Okay, sneeze litter, time to go bye bye. Time to go bye bye. Let's have some fun. I don't know anymore, and I don't care. Let us catch us some little friends. Okay, they're here. Okay, they're in sight. Let's floor some over. That should work. Do they look hungry? They do not seem to like salt. Let's try grains. Okay, they all want it! Okay, a haunter. Hello. <laughs> Stay out in the ball. Let's try a thing. Okay. Okay, we're catching a lot of Pokemon. You dumb thing. There we go. Next up, or I guess last up is Yanma. Not too hard. It's not far from here. I mean, well, it's a simple climb. Hey, it's our another whisk. That's cool. I can get more. Oh no. Okay. Let's hurry up. Yeah, shiny. And they're mad. They're all mad. Yeah. 
Better. Did catch a Yanma. Ow. Oh. Can we get an out a shiny outbreak? That'd be nice. There we go. That's the last song. Man, I feel dumb. I feel down in dumps. Uh, oh well. I guess we'll report this in. Hey, what are you doing here? Oh. Yeah, nose pass. Okay, let's just get this done. Good work out there. It seems we learned all we can from the highlands now. Adamon. There you there you are. Hope your investigation's going all right. We're doing great. I heard folks in the plan in our clan and the Pearl Clan are helping are all helping investigate these massive mass outbreaks. Or whatever you call it. And I thought, what kind of leader would uh, would sit back and do nothing while you are all working? So I figured I'd grab whatever supplies I could find that might be coming handy to you. Here, materials for those sticky glob things. Oh my god. How leader like of you. Don't make fun, my. I'm trying to help. You misunderstand me, Adamon. As the sister who helped raise you, I'm truly proud to see how far you've come. Munch, munch! I feel bad for him. Listen, Zan, I've been wondering. Do you think these mass and might at mass outbreaks could be some sort of trial from Mighty Dialga or Mighty Palkia? It's possible. I mean, it makes sense. It kind of feels like it, right? As if someone's telling us. If you got the guts to face a real test with your partners, take on these Pokemon. Otherwise, stand back. Quite like you to see it that way, Adamon. Yeah, well, I'd love to stay in talk, but I've got an appointment to keep with that Benny fellow. I'm trying to get him to teach me his tricks. You mean his cooking? You mean his ninja skills? I want to know his recipes and his ninja tricks. Once I do, I'll give you a proper demonstration. But in the meantime, stay safe as you investigate. Later. He's a nice guy. My, my. It would seem having a trusted partner causes one to view these outbreaks in a rather different light. Now then, the Alabaster Icelands. Still await. One, one more steep hurdle for us to overcome. Munch! You sir. Munch! It appears Munchlass is eager to continue as well. We'll wait for you in Ju at Jubilee's front gate as usual. Join us when you're ready for another survey. Ooh. Wait, a ball of mud. Oh my god. What? And it's doing that thing. Isn't this a sign of something? 23 Pokemon, to be precise. I'm making achievements. <laughs> Let's get all of our work done so I can rank up. Ooh. And I'm ready to rank. Let's return to the village, because I want to report this my ranking, my Pokedex a bit more. I really have to pick this. 
Hold on, Ma. I'll be there in a moment. And guys, as for you, I too will be right back. You know. And we are back. Well, we've been doing this for two hours. This is going to be a fun little video. Big video. Don't worry, Ma. I'll help you out momentarily. A moon like rock. Oh, it's so the moonstone. Jet balls. Good choice. I got the best feather ball. Oh no. Okay, so let's see what we can get. What's this all about? The Clefairy's Moonlit Dance. Oh, so we can study Clefairy! Anyways, Commander, if you have progress. Yeah, I'm ready. Hmm, you have made your you have made progress. It seems you have earned yourself a star. Been a long time since we've done this. What now? With this, you have officially attained the rank of ninth star in the Galaxy of Expedition. The rewards you earned from your for your survey reports will be more generous now. And I present you with these <gasps> rare candies and grip pebbles. Continue to dedicate yourself to completing the Pokédex and hope to rise, rise in the ranks. Thank you. With these, I can max out my level. You just, uh, you helped. Look at me, I'm my first maximum level Pokemon in this game. This will definitely make things a lot easier on me. A little too easy if you think about it. Okay, now let's go to the out of, I'm sorry, just maximum level. You look cool. You've done me so proud since you were a little Oshawott. Our last item of research is to look into the massive mass outbreaks in the Alabaster Icelands. Let's finish this together. I'm excited. If you're ready, shall we embark? Yeah, let's go. Good, let's head to the Snow Point's cave, Peak's Cape. I'm going to be looking around here for a lot of Pokemon, I hope you know. The cold air seems to cut right through you. What are you doing? Hey, Leon. Oh, no. What are you two doing here? I can advise you that the massive mass outbreak seen here, seen here in the Alabaster Iceland seems slightly different than the others. The outbreaks happen during rainstorms and other ones, but it seems they've been tied to blizzards. Blizzards, you say? It could just be the cold environment, of course, but I have to wonder if there's more to it. Well, we better get to it. I think we should look into more massive outbreaks than usual this time. More than usual? I know increasing the scope of our investigation is a lot to ask at this point. And even with someone like your skill set, it will take a long time to check so many areas by yourself. It's a good thing I'm here to help you through the out there, isn't it? And that's why even Liam might be of some use. I'm counting on you all. This will be your first time investigating these outbreaks, won't it, you two? Try not to overstrain yourselves. Certainly. So, to sum up, Stan, Stan will just focus on Freya as, as he's been doing till now. Meanwhile, Sligo and I will handle that re remaining. There's something wrong with your math, I mean, you left me out of the equation. So, you can do basic math, can you? Oh! <laughs> well, I know how to subtract you from this assignment, for starters. I will finish all the remaining areas on my own. You need to factor in. And they're back at it again. I can't tell if they hate each other or if they're both enjoying this. 
Either way, I imagine they never ha would have crossed paths if it, if it hadn't been for you. For now, let us focus on investigating the outbreaks here in the Icelands. Now, what to do? Hey, Melly. Or, oh, sorry, hey, Mai. Hey, Mai, can you do something? Okay. Let's see what we can find. We got. <gasps> do what? I didn't know do what was here. Let's check out everyone. You know what? Let's go to. Uh... Let's actually look at the Riolu one. This one here. I want to see if I can get something good out of it, like another shiny one. Because, like, I have registered shiny Lucario. Hear me out. But I still need a shiny Riolu. You know, obvious reasons, you know? This is gonna be fun. I guess. Depending on what your definition of fun is. Yeah, hey, Wild Crowbat! Let's look. Pour some over. Okay. 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 These guys are fast. <gasps> Got him. Ow! <sighs> you guys are the worst people or Pokemon. Damn it, I lost some shards! Some treasure. Man! Seems I was rescued. Let's sell my stuff, some stuff. For whatever treasure is even left at this point. Okay. Hold on. Wait, what am I doing? I should eat till after this to eat. Still, what's closest? I'm just mad, that annoyed about this. Oh, I can get a shiny Curlia.
Hey. Wasn't there a Gardevoir here? Oh yeah, I caught a Gardevoir. I don't even have one of these actually in this game. Gotcha! Just give up. Let's look at something else. Let's try out this Ralts. That'll help. And get more bellies. This is good. This is actually a nice place. I feel like I could honestly live here. Comment down below. If you had to live, if you could live anywhere in history, where would you live and why? This is perfect for me. Wait, I got a craft. I'm a crafting buddy. Dana Ling. Let's check out Duat. I actually want to see Wild Duat. That is a beautiful thing to see. And you know, as a person who has a Hisuian Samurai, I want to see a shiny Duat as well, if possible. Wild. Ow. Let's fight! Samurai versus Duat. And I caught a load of Pokemon today. Or just technically tonight, but you know. Same deal. Same shtick. And another one. Uh huh. Hmm. Oh man. Oh, let's just take these guys down. No, it's bonk on the head. Let's feed this guy. And all of them. I'm sniping.
Oh, gotcha. There you go. Done. I caught a lot of Pokemon, honestly. I caught a lot of stuff tonight. Okay, let's see what we got here. Who's my? Oh, there she is. Feel bad for her. So you fi you finished checking the free areas? You were charged with a with the nice ones. I've gotten word from Melly too. Says he says he says he's about to wrap it up. Leon and he, said he and Melly worked together to investigate the last outbreak. Well then, it seems we're done here. You worked tirelessly to investigate all across the city, but we still don't know what causes these mass out massive mass outbreaks, and they pose a threat to anyone without strong partners at their side. It'd be nice if these out uh, if these outbreaks didn't put anyone in danger, but things really work out that easily. Perhaps these way, these outbreaks are someone's way of telling us that we must better understand the Pokemon with which we share vast as Huey. Yeah, I could get behind that idea. But for now, we better, we better get going if we want to make it on time. Come along, you two. What are we doing? Huh. What is happening? This is the place. And we picked the perfect time. There we go. What do you think? It's beautiful. This lovely space given to us by Almighty Palkia. In this fleeting time, Mighty Alta, Mighty Dialga gave us. Such a beautiful thing together with you is only possible because we have to both together. Isui means so much to me. My love for it is as vast as the land. Tell me, San, did you enjoy surveying this land once again? It was a lot of fun. I actually had fun. Was it? I'm suppose I suppose it was always fun to have a mystery to delve into. I enjoyed it too. Munch. I heard these massive mass outbreaks trigger some kind of reaction in your munchlax, my. Is he doing all right? He seems fine. Pokemon remain mysterious creatures to us. Who's to say he how he does it? I'm just grateful to him for helping us find the outbreaks and telling us where what we'll where we'll find it at each. That reminds me, I've spread the word around that people the people of Hisui should be alert for massive mass outbreaks during rainstorms. Thanks for that idea for that Irda. Hopefully no more poor souls will wander into one unprepared and take a beating. Seems like our lives are gonna keep on changing. And we'll keep it that just, just as fast. An ever-changing Hisui. Tell me, Sand, how do you think the pe the future people of Hisui will live with Pokemon? They'll battle in gyms. In gyms? What is a gym? And why would you battle in one, Sand? You see, there are places where you challenge, where you can challenge a skilled battler to prove your mettle. Interesting. I'd like to be the one who deems a challenger worthy. Well, whatever may come in the future, aren't we lucky to be 
to have been born into, into such fascinating, fast-changing times? You said it. Not that change is always good, and there will always be people who don't want change at all. But hey, that's life. We will just have to work hard and push on. And I'm glad we'll all will have you with us as we do it, Sand. Thanks for everything. You certainly have some curious ideas, but I suppose that's no surprise coming from someone who fell out of the sky. We may have finished our investigations for now, but Munchlock and I will continue to help you however we can. Munch! You know, Sand, perhaps these new outbreaks truly are just a gift from Almighty So. A gift meant for you, for all the good changes you've brought to us for here in Hisui. Yay! I get a present! Daybreak. Awesome. Huh. Welcome back, Sam, and fine work with your survey. Pardon the imposition, but would you follow me to the training grounds? What's going on? What's this all about? I called you here for one very specific reason. I wish to have you try your hand at a new Pokemon battle. I used to think that Pokemon were terrifying creatures. You've helped me see otherwise. Thanks to you, there are some people in this village who, not, who now enjoy battle with Pokemon. More and more of us now see Pokemon as allies. It is for that very reason I would like you to continue to further your trailblazing. I believe that taking on part in a new form of battle will help deepen our understanding of Pokemon. In the midst of a tough battle, what does your partner desire? And what is your opponent thinking? I believe that you will have the ability to sense these things, and we will do our best to learn as well. This is quite a difficult cross read, but I'm sure you're up to the challenge. You may ask Ingo here for a more detailed explanation. I leave the rest to you, Ingo. Ingo! Please let me know when you are ready. To try your hand at these ba new battles. Who do you want? Pack of Solitude. Huh. Ooh. Oh my god. Bidoof. Eevee! Not finished yet. Wormadam. Abra. Blissey. Still more to go. Sneasel. Rotom. Bastiodon. Roselia. Magikarp. Once you've cleared the path of solitude with any of the Pokemon I just mentioned, come show me the mark in your Pokedex. Garrett. Okay. Cool. That happened. Wait, how many do I have to find? So I have to find three. Five, seven, eight, nine, ten. So many. I have to find thirty more. One more. Okay. Well, you know what? That's it for this video. So thank you all very much for watching, and thank you for tuning into the level max leveling of this guy. Let's do our best. You know.
I'm very proud of my Pokemon. You know? Let's get you all dealt with. Let's get you dealt with. You're doing just fine. But anyway, thank you all very much for watching. And as always, I will see you all next time on Pokemon Legends Arceus. Bye, guys.